Hi, it's AI Lisa here. Welcome back to Ask the Instructor presented by Campus Mortgage. Today's question is, the property seller is involved in a short sale. What documentation is needed for the loan file? Here is what our mortgage instructor has to say. When the seller of a property is involved in a short sale, to prevent foreclosure on the home, their lender will have the final say on the sales price, repair costs, and even any closing costs being paid on behalf of the new buyer. Furthermore, there may even be a final figure that must be paid to that lender at closing, and this approval may not be consistent with the purchase contract terms. As the lender on the new loan, we must make sure we have a signed copy of the existing lender's approval and all terms related to it. Moreover, the closing statement on the new loan must match all terms of the short sale approval. This concludes our one-minute video. If you like this video, please help us by clicking the like button and consider subscribing to our channel. And remember, at Campus Mortgage we'd offer a variety of comprehensive mortgage training and certification programs. To learn how we can help jumpstart your mortgage career, simply download our course catalog at campusmortgage.org. Thank you and make it a great day!